Hello everyone, this is Kevin Hogan from Northern California with another episode of California Comic Con Adventures. This is part two of our episode about Fanime 2022. Uh, as you may remember, they took a little uh, break from the COVID pandemic there. Uh, Fanime uh, started in 1994. Uh, Fanime Con uh, was first created by several anime clubs that came together to share their passion for anime. Uh, some of the original clubs still remain and many others have joined Fanime Con since. Um, now, for those of you interested, there are volunteering opportunities. If you want to find out more information, you can go to fanime.com. Um, and for those of you that want to learn more about them, uh, FanimeCon is Northern California's largest anime convention. Uh, they are known as By Fans for Fans, is their slogan. Uh, they're packed with nonstop video programming, extraordinary costumes, music, games, tournaments, panels, and they're uh, renowned for international guests and celebrities. Uh, they're an annual celebration of Japanese art and popular cultural entertainment. It's a very colorful event for uh, fans, friends, and all sorts of interesting cosplay and activities there. Uh, Fanime Con of 2019 had over 34,000 attendees before the COVID pandemic there. And in 2022, there were several thousand there. Uh, they lined the uh, uh, San Jose Convention Center's entrance all the way down the street from both ends of the block and around the corner there, waiting to get in there uh, to show their uh, clear pass vaccines there to get in. It was a really fun time. Lots of friends there in attendance there, seeing lots of colorful causeways there. Uh, they did have some panels there. Uh, we saw 5th Gen uh, Not Pokemon there doing their comedy show there. It was great fun there with their Waluigi show there. Um, some of the uh, events there, like the Cosplay Contest and Cosplay Chess, uh, were postponed uh, for this year. They'll be coming back uh, for 2023, later years, uh, for uh, not having some of the more crammed together events there because of COVID there. But there were some uh, events still going on there. It was nice there. They still had uh, dance to so the rave parties going on in the evening there. Uh, they still had the big vendor hall there. With lots of uh, vendors to see there. It was really cool. And uh, for those of you interested in other upcoming events coming up there, at the Fresno Fairgrounds on Saturday, June the 11th, is Anime Fuse's car show. Uh, so that would be interesting to check out there in, so, in the central Southern California area there. And uh, also for fans of Ohana Comic Con at the uh, Turlock area there on Sunday, June the 12th, uh, they're going to be coming there to central California there so you can check that out there. Well, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy the pics.